Okay. That's good. The mini session. <clears throat> All right, we're good. Very good. I'm checking to see who's coming back, you know, whoever enters the yep. enters the room. Awesome. Yep, Cheryl Moyer. I'm letting her in. Hey Cheryl. Yay. She's connecting now. We have no idea who's going to be joining, right? Nope. <laughs> it's just a free for all today. <laughs> and we're waiting for Heather as well, right? Yep. Okay. <clears throat> Good. Okay. Really? He has bells? He has a bell. <laughs> oh my goodness. And of course, he's like Rachel annoyed by it. Is that itching you? going on rascal can they hear you and you hear her can you hear me maybe do we can lower your volume I think. can you hear jennifer can you guys hear me i'm not getting any response so i don't think we can hear you yes okay oh, thank you i right. <laughs> just want to make sure we're good all right, I'm, as people come in, I'll admit them. Good boy. Hello. Hi. All right. <laughs> you going to start running up and down the stairs, asshole? <laughs> Got a bell on now. Mm -hmm. Now we can hear every move. Ding, 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 ding. Hi. Stop. You're fine. Crazy dog. You all right, Rascal? <laughs> <laughs> he loves the looks at you when he talks to you. Hi, it's okay. Aiden put a bell on you, huh? It's okay. Aiden put a bell on him? Yep. Is that the spot right there? Is that the okay. spot? Is that the spot right there? We'll give everyone a couple of minutes. We just popped on early. Yep, we got two minutes. Yeah, we got a while. Mm -hmm. A couple minutes, not a while. A couple minutes. Where's Aiden? Go get him. Right, get we're him. still waiting for um, Heather. Yes. Go get Aiden. Go get him. I'm not going right now. Yeah, don't get him all worked up. <laughs> you look like he's ready to go outside. Yeah, probably. Calm down. So <laughs> <That> look. <laughs> Calm down. <laughs> lay down, rascal. He doesn't want to lay down. He doesn't want to lay down. I don't know where am I? <laughs> so loud. I was working with the two, the two computers on, but how are you guys doing? I'm sorry about the feedback before. How are you guys? We're good. Right. <laughs> We're good. Am I doing the stitch painting? Okay, it's an event. That's for the 24th. Oh. That's for the 24th. Oh, cause what are we doing now? We're doing just this little guy, just this little painting today. I can't see it. Today. That's all. Curtains. Oh. <laughs> I mean, you could make a blue. Jay. You could make a blue jays if you want. <laughs> yeah, you can make them whatever color bird you want. Okay. My mini angry birds. This is what yeah, everybody angry calls. Birds. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna have to zoom in for those birds. I'll zoom we in. We did the large version of this, but uh we're just doing a mini version today. And, and there, there goes the cuckoo clock. clock. Yep. Does that mean we're cuckoo? Oh my uh, goodness. Yeah, we're going cuckoo. You made me he made me go cuckoo over the cuckoo clock. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm so glad to go cuckoo clock. It's so nice. Hey, Aiden. I know I just talked to you like 10 minutes ago. I know. 
Yeah, there's a glare right now on the painting, but when I zoom in, then the glare will go away. There you go. Hi. 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 Yeah, we're at 501 now. We're waiting for Heather. Mm -hmm. well, hold on, there's some more people coming in. Now. Okay, I fixed it. Thank you. We heard okay. it. That was the five o'clock show. That was the five o'clock show. My okay. gosh. <laughs> uh. Yes, Heather. Yay. Okay. Hello. Hi. Hello. How's everybody doing? Good. How are you? Good. Still getting set up. Okay. Okay. All right. We got a few people. Yeah. Oh, we got, yeah. got a couple of good people on with us. Good. 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 Yeah. Well, it's a rainy you, day in California. Doing fine. <laughs> Yay! Is it? Yeah, is Grandma. Hi, Grandma. Oh, I love Terry. You got letter <laughs> Okay, so here's our set. Let's see. I got my finger over, and I've got the antlers on. <laughs> ah, I did my hat. <laughs> <laughs> now I just gotta figure out where I'm gonna set this up in this messy room. Okay. Get a couple books to prop it on. This is not the normal, the normal spot. I'm keeping an eye on so did, you did you tell people about the prizes? I didn't, no. Wait, let's turn this around. I'm upside down here. You can show them. Let's show them. Here. Let's see. Should I pin her? Yeah. I'm going to prop it up a little bit here. Yeah, let her get, let her get set up. <clears throat> I don't know if that's going to be sturdy enough. Let's see. Okay, so. Yeah, let me turn it. We've got two of these fabulous art kits. Okay. And these string of beautiful lights, LED lights. Ooh. And then we've got a second kit. So we've got two of these. Okay. And then I have to go to the basement to get a bottle of wine, but. Got, this is a little candle light holder. This is going to be one of the gifts, door prizes. Okay. And then this little cute basket will come with a bottle of wine, which I have to go pick in the basement. <laughs> All right. Good, yeah. good. <laughs> red, red or, red or, uh, I guess ask the audience, red or white? What's the preference? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> And this is for our hostess with the mostest, Jennifer. This is your hostess gift. I love it. Aww. <laughs> so when it says, for those that can't, can't read it, it says, I can totally make that. That's totally you, right? Awesome. That's what we say as like crafters and artists. We just say, I can make that. And then you're like $100 into it and going, I should have just bought it. It would have been cheaper. We still got people joining in. I'm just admitting them. Yeah. So I think I need to put this a little lower. How about here? Yeah, a little bit lower would be good. Is that better? <laughs> yeah, that's good. That's your chair. That's where you're going to sit. Yep. Yep, that's perfect. Though. But it, you know, you don't need to watch me. We need to watch Jennifer. She's she's <laughs> expert. Okay. We're having tacos tonight. And Saturday and Tuesday. Yay! He, he he just showed us a piece of his artwork. Do you want to show us again? I don't think Jennifer saw that. Hold no. On. Hold on, I'm coming. She Why don't you hold it up? Oh, hold it up again. Yes. What did you do? Good job. Oh, cool. Good job. <laughs> yeah. Um, my karate school did like a um drawing night, so we got to draw stuff. Mm -hmm on Zoom, so um, that's one of the things that we did. Awesome. And we did like Rudolph, and we did Santa, and then after I did a bunch with my mom, my mom also did the Zoom. I wake up, turn the light on, and then she looked over at me, like this. Hmm? 
Very good. Oh, all right. What? So I'm going to go run to the basement and get a bottle of wine. Do you want to get everything started or? Sure, we can get started. I'm going to put myself on mute. Okay. I still have people coming in, so I'm going to hit it. Okay. Pop-tart. You need right, a pop Yeah, show the gift. You want to believe the pop Take the bottle of wine. Hey. Like, huh? If you want to take a break, I can show them again. <laughs> We're going to have everybody mute themselves unless you need to chat in. <laughs> Jennifer? Yes. Hey, it's not showing me on the screen. Can you see me? It's Anita. Hi, Anita. I do not see Anita, but I see her name. Oh, so your camera's yeah. not on. Your camera's not on. Uh, Try the bottom left-hand side of your screen. It should be a little button for your camera. It says start video. Yep, that's yes. it. Okay. Um, we're doing stitch today? No, no, not stitch well, not today. today. Okay. We're doing the doing those the cardinals. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Oh. There's Anita. I see her now. Yay! There. All right. Okay. Yeah, a couple minutes. I know this was kind of like a new way to go about doing this. We just thought we're gonna throw the throw the link right up there for you guys and whoever joins joins. <laughs> <laughs> Jennifer, you should do more Zoom events. So instead of like looking in chat all the time, um, you can uh, people can just talk to you and like it will be much more easier. Sometimes, sometimes it is, yeah. Sometimes when there's a whole lot of people, it's tougher because everybody trying to talk. We can't the same time. we can't hear everyone at the same time. Right. <laughs> and then when people are not on mute, then there's tons of feedback. So the the there's just a different dynamic to to deal with. That's all. <laughs> and some people are just more comfortable with putting in chat. And yeah, in that's chat okay. Session. Whatever makes you guys happy, you guys can chat it in, type it in, unmute today, and chat when you have a question. It's just a nice little, a quick one today. That's all. All right, Clavina says that they're from uh, Alaska. Hi, guys. And um, they want to thank us for doing this and that they're here watching and they're ready to go. Awesome. Very good. Are donations done via Facebook? Uh, so I don't do any um, payments through Facebook at all. Nothing. Right. No payments, no links through Facebook. Everything's through our website, mimosasmasterpieces.com. There, um, in, the, in the event, I'll post a little many thanks. Um, and we'll post our tip jar information there if you'd like to use the tip jar. Um, but yeah, uh, we appreciate those. <laughs> so we'll give everyone so another minute or so. Because I'm, I'm still checking, I'm still checking to see if anybody else is joining us. OK. Well, we can get, go over kind of some of our supplies um, before we get started, and then we'll We'll get yeah. working. Huh? And I'm going to zoom in on that because of the glare. Yes. And I'm going to have to move Stitch out of the picture because we're going to zoom in closer to the car. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Let me know if it works. Yeah, it's good. Okay. Better. Okay, I'm unmuting myself, you guys. So okay. we have Guglielmo Zinfandale. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, or yeah. if the person yeah. prefers white, there's the Chardonnay. Woohoo! And oh, okay. I, I'm, I'm not a Chardonnay person, so this is probably something that someone gave me. <laughs> <laughs> and it's a 2018 Sonoma Russian River, which as some of you know, Russian River, a lot of it's burned. Oh, so this wow. is probably a very good bottle of wine. And Guglielmo is a winery that in the Prohibition, down near Gilroy, they kept producing wine in their basement. So they're a very long winded wine company that kept producing even though they were they were told not to but they said we're doing it for the church and so here's two nice bottles and yeah awesome, awesome. <laughs> well thank you thanks for doing that we like we like spoiling our audience and giving stuff away <laughs> <laughs> awesome well i um heather do you want to talk a few minutes about um what se tags is so our viewers that are newer to this can hear about it um sure but give me a minute i'm gonna go i'm gonna go grab one more thing and people are people still checking in yeah, yeah. Still checking in. yeah. okay i'll be right back okay I'm gonna go just i'm gonna put this down and i'll be right back okay all right 
right. <laughs> yeah, just a few more minutes and then we'll get started. Sounds good. Yeah, we usually wait until about five after, so we're we're ten after. Yeah, we got a nice little crowd. <laughs> just want to make sure that anybody else is trying to get in. Yeah, in. we know it's a again, it's a newer way of trying to do this. And then we'll let Heather come back. We're just going to do one more thing and then we'll get started. Awesome. So while we're doing that, I can zoom back out. Okay. <laughs> I did do your uh, gingerbread men too, you guys. The one of the gingerbread men for the gingerbread men and man and woman. Yes. You're correct. See, everybody's so used to saying gingerbread men. We've got to change that trend. Okay. Your gingerbread people, here you go. There you go. Gingerbread people. Let me zoom in. Hold on, leave right there. <laughs> I like the gingerbread man. <laughs> See, even they're saying gingerbread man. <laughs> okay, so we, we did something a little new. So this will be our early afternoon painting for Christmas Eve. And then we'll come back later in the evening and do stitch, right? Okay. So it'll be stitch and gingerbread people? Yep. That was our end of end of the year. End of December, final paintings. I may try and squeeze one more in there after Christmas. <laughs> um, Christina says, I can't stay for the full painting. Will I be able to watch That's it okay. later? Yeah, we'll record it and we'll, we'll post it. Um, if you want to just send us your email, um, I can email you the unedited version. <laughs> okay. Mark may cut it up later. And <laughs> I'm having trouble cutting. I'm having trouble with the um... Zooms. The the one we did uh no last night the polar, the polar express. express yeah oh that wasn't even on Zoom though it wasn't but it's I'm having some kind of trouble so I shut my computer down I'm oh. gonna come back to it tomorrow I don't know what's going on okay I tried to do it three times I tried to work on it three times today and now I don't even have sound I don't know what's going on oh man okay right <laughs> um. Okay, we're recording, so, oh. Um, okay, I'm back. Oh, yes, Suzanne said, um, gingerbread nine binary person. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Let me, I'm gonna turn the sound off on this one. There we go. And I'm gonna grab my other glasses. glasses. And my super I was gonna say, okay. I think you just turned it. Yeah. <laughs> Hold on. There we go. All right. Very good. I'm stopping that video. Oh, it's still echoing. It's, I don't know why it's echoing. I guess when you have two. Yep. Yes, you have two, you get feedback. Okay. I'm what size cables are you using? I'm turning it down. Okay, and then I'll uh, I'll shut the other one down. But um, for everybody out there, SV Tags is an educational website and TV show that we've been around, it's going on 12 years. And the idea was to create uh, educational events to connect, and I'll just read the mission statement because I always forget what it is, but it's basically what we've been working on. Our mission is uh, to share information about companies, nonprofits, and people and places connecting technology, art, green, and sustainability, tags. And of course, when I went to buy tags, it was taken by a meta tag company and another company that wanted $20,000. So tags, SV tags was born. Um, the intention is to foster growth and learning in the areas of TAG's interest, um, interest, which is the tech, art, green, and, and sustainability, and connecting people, industry, and resources. So we love what Jennifer's doing, and we had Jennifer on our 201st show, along with a gal named Kayla from North Carolina. Right. And uh, you'll be able to see that they're still editing it, it's still 43 minutes right now. It has to be down to 29.5 <laughs> minutes. <laughs> to, to yeah and, and gopher sent it back to me it was like heather it's only at 43 minutes you need to cut more so i'm trying to figure out what it is going to cut and i think i decided today even without the show credits and all that i think maybe what we'll do is we'll just publish the 43 minutes on youtube this week and we'll let you publish it okay. the way it is and um and then the shorter version will be on the 20 station sorry and i'm, I'm my half my head's here the the uh, the edited down to 29 minutes and a half will be on the 20 stations here in Silicon Valley. 
Okay. And, uh, and then, of course, as people know, there's public access stations all around the U.S., Boston, New Jersey, uh, New Hampshire, everywhere. And they say the Oprah effect, when Oprah left network TV, it was like a vacuum, but there still was eyes on the public access. So Massachusetts alone has like 500 public access stations. So our plan was always to go to other places, and we bought Tags USA and USA Tags this last year to do that. But of course, COVID, we haven't been able to go and film on location this year. Mark, you know my grief there, right? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So anyway, I'm so excited that we're doing this with you and we're going to start trying to do either a quarterly or monthly something with different artists. That's and we have uh, two more lined up right now. So awesome. That's great. Yeah. Do you guys want me to show the gifts again? Sure, you can go ahead and show the gifts again and then we'll get started. Okay, and I'm going to put this in mute and I'm going to start the video on the other one. Okay. Stop the video here. <laughs> okay. So we'll begin in a few minutes. Okay, okay, so, so nope. get a basket number one, depending on your likes of your wine, and this will have some beautiful kind of gold and green wrapping around it. Okay. And door prize number two, this beautiful candle holder, and it will have a little LED light in it. All right. And... We got two art kits and it says a hundred pieces. So there we go, two art kits. And then these other little lights, which are very cute. They're, it says Ashland Christmas, Christmas Noels. They're like little snowflake lights. All cute. Right. Okay. Awesome. And somebody coming in right now for you, huh? Okay, kids. All right. All right, we ready to go? Let's Let me put it. myself on mute. Okay, okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna Awesome. So we did a, a larger version of this painting a couple of months ago. So I thought this is a cute little painting that we could uh, that we can use for a, just a, a quick painting. Shouldn't be that, that long. So um, I, I, I did it on eight by 10, but I actually have a 10 by 10 canvas. Of course you can use whatever size you want, just enlarge your image based on your, uh, the size of your canvas. So just use Five, our five primary colors and brown, so red, yellow, blue, black, white, and a little bit of brown. Okay. Little bit of everything. You don't need a whole lot for this at all. A uh, cup of water to rinse my brushes, paper towels to dry. And then we'll use today our half inch flat brush like this, a medium round brush like this. Actually, yeah, no, that's fine. And then a tinier detail brush for those little details on our canvas. Okay. All right. So I'm going to work on the background. Once we get our background done, then we're going to give it a few minutes to dry. We can talk to you about a few of our upcoming events and then we'll go from there. So that tiny brush, all I'm going to have you do is grab a corner of white and a corner of blue on that brush. Hi, buddy. He made me tea. Thank you, dude. There you go. Let's Thank you. Great job. Be careful you don't drink I won't that. drink that. Thank you. And don't put the paintbrush in, in the tea. tea. <laughs> I know. That's what you did last time with you are. <laughs> <laughs> and so, you almost drank one of them. You did say you were going to do it, and you I did. Know. I said not to do it. Don't do it. Corner of white, corner of blue. And all we're doing oh. is creating kind of a texture in our background by doing X's. So we're just going to keep overlapping those X's. All throughout the whole canvas. Now, the larger the brush, the faster this goes. So grab those edges as well. Cool. And then just keep going. Corner of blue, corner of white, and we're just making X's throughout our whole canvas. Okay, back out. The more white you have, the lighter it is. The more blue you have, the darker it is. But we do have little white birch trees that we're going to put on here. So uh, if it's a little bit darker, that's fine. Your little birch trees will stick out a little better than, I said little a lot of times right there. I'm sorry. <laughs> I just annoyed myself. <laughs> so just X's, overlapping those X's across the entire canvas. Rascal does not care about dinner if mom is standing right here. I fed him and I have a schedule on this Thank you. Bowl. Oh, I you put a schedule on the bowl? For me. Thank you. 
and for anybody who's watching him. Thank you. So they know what time to feel. I'm just going back, corner blue, corner white. And just keep going. So Jennifer, you're making X's with the white and the blue? Together, yep. So on my brush, I take a little corner of white and a little corner of blue. White on one side, blue on the other. And then I just wipe it back and forth and overlap it. And I'm blending as I go. Yeah, you have the canvas sort of tilted. Is it? Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> And you're doing the edges. And I'm doing the edges, yeah. I was trying to hold on to it so it doesn't fall off. Okay. I'm gonna so then I just keep going back into corner of blue, corner of white, and just keep overlapping those X's. So you're kind of creating that background, that sky texture as you go. Okay. Corner blue, corner white. Crazy dog. Would you relax? Calm down. You were outside. Now relax. What is it? It's like every other day he's going to be excited. Crazy? I don't know. Well, you know, you put this, uh, Aiden put that bell on him, <laughs> and he's trying to lick the bell, or eat the bell. I don't, don't know. Eat the bell. All right, all right. I'm taking the bell off. Calm down. There you go. Okay? Better? That's better. I just flip my canvas upside down so I can get the bottom. Okay. Corner of blue, corner of white. Right, you just flipped your canvas. Uh huh. Don't matter. There's no top or bottom here. Yeah, I think the bell was bothering him. Because now he's laid down where he normally lays where you start. <laughs> All right. That's it. We are off to painting. And of course, when everybody's done with their background and doing their X's, then they'll give us a thumbs up. Yeah. And let us know that they're ready to move on to the next step. Yeah, I mean, we do have to give this a minute or so to dry so we can talk about what's coming up if you want to. Oh, okay, we already got some thumbs up. Oh, wow. All right, now. Yeah. <laughs> so we can talk about what's coming up. Let's go over those. Well, we got Tuesday, December 15th at 8 p.m. Eastern Time. We'll yes. be doing the Peanuts characters, Snoopy and Woodstock. That's for a paint it forward. We'll be doing that on Zoom. Yes. I'm trying to get it without putting my head in this can and this thing here. Let's see. Here they are. Now, you know I'm zoomed in, so you got to be uh, okay. careful how you place it. I'm I'll zoom. back out. <laughs> okay, you can turn it around. There you go. Okay, so this is the Paint It Forward. What we're doing for this one is for a $5 donation, it, you'll get the Zoom link, but when you send in your donation, I want you to tell us where the money should go. I want you to give us the name of a charity or an organization that is um, personal to you, near and dear to your heart. And we're going to, instead of giving away prizes for this night, we're going to take the funds and all of the funds will go to one charity or organization. So instead of your name going on the spinner, your charity or organization's name will go on the spinner. We'll spin live at the end of this so that we know what organization all of the funds will go to. Mm -hmm. We are almost at $300 already. Awesome. For the organization, so yes, that's super, super, super cheap. So that'll be this Tuesday. That's this Tuesday. At 8 p.m. Eastern time. Yes. And that's on Zoom. Where do they get the Zoom link? Zoom link. They're going to sign up on the Moses Masterpieces dot com. Okay, that's the sign up right there. Yep. Okay. Then uh, two days later, Thursday, we have a double header day. Mm -hmm. Okay, Thursday at uh, 
4 p.m. Eastern time, we'll be doing the alpaca slaw on a Zoom event. <laughs> That's Bob Boop and Buzz that are riding the alpaca. <clears throat> Where did this come from? This thing? Yeah, that came from <laughs> that piece right there. So we're going to paint this together on Zoom. We will be Zooming with the alpaca farm so that you get to see some of the alpacas kind of live. Um, oh, that's right. We'll be um, doing a little, a little yeah. Zoom meeting with them, right? Yep. And they just had babies. So I'm hoping that the babies will be around to see the babies. That's awesome. OK. All right, but that's going to be at 4 p.m. Eastern time on December 17th. Then yes. later that night, 8 p.m., we'll be doing Ralphie in the bunny suit. That's going to be free on uh, Facebook. And we're expecting special guests for that night? We are. Three now. We're up to three. Oh, we got a third? Yes. Okay, so somebody took my names. Uh, they're in the bin. That's why. Sorry. Uh, I don't, oh, there we are. Yes. Yes. We'll be having um, Yano Anaya, who played Grover Dill in the movie, and Ian Petrella, who played Randy in the movie. And who's the third person? Zach Ward, who was Scott Farkas. Oh, Zach Ward? Yes. So and what was his character? Scott Farkas. Oh, Scott. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so we'll have three people join us in the chat that day. Yes. So those are evening. the actors from the original movie. The original movie, A Christmas Story. That's right. Right, so we'll be doing Ralphie in the bunny suit from A Christmas Story at 8 p.m. Uh, December 17th. That's our self-care Thursday. Yes, it is. All right, so that's a double header, one on Zoom and one on Facebook. Yep. All right. Hey, guys, another silly question. So I'm behind. I've just got my paint set up. Yeah. So for people that are behind, and you don't have to wait for me, is it the big flat brush you were using for the X's? Yep. Yes. So, so your flat brush like this, or okay. if you have a bigger one, you can use a bigger one. But yes, corner of white, same thing. Corner of white, corner of blue, and you're just doing X's, overlapping okay. those X's until it's full. Right. Okay. Okay. All right. Um, we've got thumbs up. We've got people saying they're ready. I'm still pretty wet here, so so I. You're still pretty wet. It's still pretty wet, so I want right, to so give I'll it a, a. I'll read another of it. Yeah, I want to. I want to give it a few minutes to dry if we can. Um, <laughs> Okay. Now, um, that that's Saturday, next Saturday, December 19th. We're going to be revisiting the Nightmare Before Christmas because we've done that, we've done that, we've done that event already. Yeah. But um, we're going to do it again because people love it so much. We're going to be doing Jack and Sally. Sally will be painting at 3 p.m. That's Saturday, December 19th, <coughs> Eastern Time. And, and then later Jack. that night, 9 p.m. Eastern time, we'll be doing Jack. There's Jack right there. Yeah, Sally's on my side. Sorry. Oh, Sally's over on the other side. Yeah, all right. Let me get her. Sorry. Yeah, you gotta get Sally. Right <laughs> Ow, rascal. Get out of the way. My goodness. Okay, so we have Sally and Jack. Right. We'll be doing both of them next Saturday, December 19th. Sally will be at 3 p.m. Eastern time, and Jack will be at 9 p.m. Eastern time. That's right. That's free on our Facebook. On our Facebook. That's uh, right. Our Facebook page. Yeah. <laughs> Very good. All right. So we want to continue on. We'll repeat the steps for the next few steps. All right. I'm going to zoom back in. We're going to try and make this work. We'll see if it works out for us. Okay. So I'm going to rinse and dry that medium round brush now. Rinse, dry. And I'm just going to go into my white. So I'm just taking white and we're going to start with making our trees. Now you can make your trees as wide or as thin as you want to. Mm -hmm. And you can make as few or as many as you want to. So we're just going to do kind of a straight line down and it doesn't have to be super straight. A little straight line all the way down to the bottom of our canvas. So how's that going? Is it, is it uh, dry enough for you? Yeah, it's working out. If you happen to pull a lot of that blue paint off of there, yeah. just rinse and dry your brush and go back into white. But I you want their backgrounds to be dry. Yeah, semi-dry. So maybe they could um, wave it around or something? Or... <laughs> you could, yeah. It's all right. If you happen to pull some of that blue on there, it's okay. Mine is still wet. 
Yeah. yeah, if it's still wet, then maybe we should wait a little bit longer for it to dry. Yeah, it's a little wet still. But yours is okay, Jennifer. That's all right. Still a little wet? It is a little wet still. Okay. <clears throat> That's right, some people that. are still blending their blue in their corner of white and their corner of blue. Right. So it's no rush. You take your time. That's right. So you'll just make a couple little trees with your white. Right, and you can make as many trees as you like, or you can make the width of your trees as big as you like or as small as you like. It's about your personal creative freedom. Yep. You just kind of making it a little bit wider as they get toward the bottom. Okay. Oh, I got yellow in that one. Sorry. Excuse you, rascal. Goodness. So again, we're just grabbing some white, adding white to those, to that canvas. And that's it, just the white. Just the white, yeah, I mean, I happen to, Pick up some yellow on mine, that's all. That was an accident. Okay. But it works, it's okay. <laughs> yeah. All right. So again, we'll give you guys a couple of minutes. Right, so when they get when they get finished doing their background and X's mm -hmm. with their blue corner of blue and corner of white, then they're gonna let that dry. Yep. Maybe they could wave it around a little bit. Maybe yep. that could accelerate the drying process. A yes, bit. that'll work. And then once that is once that is achieved, then they're just going to take the same brush and we're going to get another brush. We're going to switch to that medium round brush and do a couple of trees in there. Right, which is really just white. Yep. And it's going to go from top to bottom. Yep. Uh, as thick or as thin as you think is good for how many yeah. trees that you want to put in your paint. That's right. So, I mean, I'm working on a 10 by 10 canvas. Right. So I have one that's about an inch thick, about three quarter inches and another inch. Okay. But you can make them again as wide or as thin as you want to. And I have it zoomed up so they can see it. Awesome. Um, and then we just leave it like that for now until everybody catches it. Yep, that's fine. The only thing you'll have left to do with that white for right now, yeah. once you have these trees in there, is grab a a little scoop of white and then come right across the bottom oh. like a little snow bank in here okay hey jennifer i was going to ask you can you address to people how to deal with the corners like so i just pulled my canvas off my easel uh -huh. to deal with the top and the bottom yep how do you deal with that so that you know for so it gets paint on the edges too um so yeah what i did was after i painted it i flipped my canvas over and i did the other side so I just grabbed, I, this was my top, mm -hmm. and then I flipped it, and then I started working from this side back down. Okay. <laughs> and then I rinse and dry. We'll give you guys a couple of minutes right. to get that going. <clears throat> right, there's no rush. No. Time. Lay I'm down. Back out. Lay down. See what's going on here with Rascal? Lay down. Lay down. Down. Lay down. Rascal seems to be having a problem today. He doesn't want you to paint. Lay down. Stop. I think he just wants you to uh relax. To tend to his needs today. I yeah. Know. I'm talking about you. Yeah, you. <laughs> the ears are back. Yeah, what are the ears back for? What happened? I'm talking about me. Yes. Yeah, there you go. Find your spot, relax, <laughs> wait for mommy to get done. She's not going to be doing this all night. Oh my Take goodness. It easy. Crazy dog. Yeah, just relax. Take it easy. <laughs> Let mommy do Jennifer, this is, this is my solution to a water thing. Reuse oh. a milk jug. <laughs> a milk jug? <laughs> oh my goodness. Yep. Lots it's of water. Look that. at that blue in there. Beautiful color. Yeah. Aid would love that. <laughs> Yeah, she's got a cut cut jug. Okay. Like Aiden does. Aiden uses them all the time. And she's got the water in there, so this way she doesn't uh, accidentally put a brush in a cup. Well, that could still happen. <laughs> oh, <okay. laughs> 
Oh my goodness. What else do we have coming up? So we did, so the 19th was Jack and Sally. Right. And then the we 19th had... is Jack and Sally. And then the next thing that we have coming up after that would be um, Tuesday, Paint It Forward, the Nutcracker Globe. Oh yeah. That's going to be on Facebook? It is actually a Zoom. Oh, okay. Because you to say that. Sorry. That's so... all right. I'm writing it down now. So yes, this was my original. So what I did was um, I made this, I wanted the girl bigger. So the sketch that you'll get for your uh, painting, this image is gonna be larger in the globe. Okay. So, just so you know. <laughs> but I, I didn't need to paint it over again. So uh, there is two organizations that we're supporting. So there's two links in the um, Mimosa's Masterpieces website. Mm -hmm. You pick whichever one you wanna support. And again, we, we uh, you know, the funds go to each of those organizations. Okay. But that's going to be uh, December 22nd. That's Tuesday night, 7 p.m. Eastern time. That's right. And then, of course, you know we were going to uh, schedule a session on Christmas, Christmas Eve. Eve. So we, as, a matter, as a matter of fact, we're going to have a double header. <laughs> uh, didn't we have a double header on Thanksgiving? No, we just no, did we one. Just did the two penguins. We just did the yeah, the mom and me penguins. Right, but we had a whole weekend. Yeah, that's what we did. So yeah, we did. On th um, Thursday, December twenty fourth, Christmas Eve, at two p.m., we're going to start early. Yeah, we're going to do the gingerbread people. That's right. All right, that's going to sure. be two p.m. Eastern time on Facebook again. That's a free event on Facebook, and then that evening at eight p.m. We'll get our hot chocolates and get everything ready, <laughs> and we'll do stitch. And stitch is over there. All right, let me move over to the side. Let me move over to the side so we can see stitch. There's not going to be sketches for gingerbread men, but there is a sketch for stitch. Okay, so if they need the sketch for stitch, how do they do it? Sign up on the website, mimosasmasterpieces.com. One word. Yeah. And then uh, the information will be right there in the event. Correct. You'll see stitch. You just click on that. Use self care all caps as your promo code. as your promo code so you can get rid of this dollar fee. That's right. Because why do we have a dollar fee? This website does not allow me to put anything up there for free. So that's just so that nobody's confused when they get up there <laughs> and say, "Why is it a dollar?" Yeah. Okay. So that way we'll have everybody ready to do stitch on Christmas Eve. Yes. So yeah, we got it all set up for you on Christmas Eve. Yeah. Starting early with the gingerbread people That's that right. our viewers requested. That's what they wanted. True. True, true. Okay, now Susan Suzanne says, um, Hi, Susan. along with the virtual chip jar, will there be a link to support SV, SV tags? Yes, we will have Heather post her link up on the uh, on the Facebook page as well. So Heather, um, in the in the link on the Facebook event mm -hmm. uh we'll have you post for sv tags so we can use your tip jar too okay because yes that would help uh help with the cost of editing <laughs> so we can get 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 our uh 201st show up yes we know it takes time uh to edit uh, i know originally i know when mark was like oh i'll edit stuff i'm like okay let's go what's gonna take it so long but no, watching it and seeing seeing the time that it takes, and even just me when I was putting the slideshow things together for um, for the event, for yeah for the seven. photos, it takes a long time to save everyone's photos, edit the photo, turn it the right way, <laughs> get it in succession. It, it takes some time to get all that together. So yes, sometimes we need to pay people to do those things. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, so uh, yeah, Mark, it's nice when we get paid for those things, right? Absolutely. <laughs> absolutely. Mark is a professional filmmaker, and uh, so uh, I, you know, normally we we don't do a lot of fundraising. We look for advertisers, which are called sponsors of the nonprofit stations, uh -huh. um, and we we are um, we are eligible to be a nonprofit, but we haven't filed for that. Um, and we've done a couple where we've done um oh my gosh i can't remember the name of the group right now but um not meetup but one of the fundraising groups 
So um, I'll put that link back up, but you know, what yeah. would be really nice is if people tipped you and we could share tips or whatever for this one. Um, and I can put that up and our plans are to become a 501c3 since we've done 201 educational shows on 20 right. public access stations, right? That's so we're eligible awesome. for that. Um, so yeah, I appreciate it. I don't know who asked that, but I appreciate the question. And there's the, the long of the short of it is we're not a nonprofit yet. Yeah, but that's, that's yeah. That's okay. Yeah. And I really would like people to tip you guys because you're doing a great job. And, and girl, you need a break. <laughs> when this is done, when this is done, you, you're like doing something every night. You're, you're guy, you guys need to go like sit on a tropical island for a few days, you know, <laughs> or something, you know, go down to Florida. That's a cabin you, in right? a mountain somewhere. Where yeah, she I don't have cabin cabin access to anything. Somewhere. That's what, that would be the best thing for me. For me, that's when I had like the biggest break when my mom and stepdad, we all went to Elk County. I just talked about that the other day, Elk County. We did not have internet access. I, there was no phones, no internet. There was nothing. So yeah, uh, I and read. where where is that? It was Elk County, Pennsylvania. It was like a six-hour drive from me, and I'm okay. in New Jersey. I mean, and you know, okay. Pennsylvania is huge. So yeah, so it's Elk like it's like for us if I drive down to see my sister in Southern California, it's like, you know, right. six to seven hours. San Diego's yeah. like eight hours. But oh my gosh. Yeah. I mean, so that was the best thing for me that I couldn't work, I guess. <laughs> so, and for you guys, you're really close to like Florida, like for driving to Florida for you is like driving to Southern California for us. Right. Isn't that like an yeah. eight hour drive? 18. How long? No. 18. Yeah. 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 I would say 18. Right. Eight hours would be like South Carolina, right? Yeah. North Carolina, maybe. Maybe North Carolina. Yeah. Well, yeah. and apparently there's a bunch of like private islands that you can unplug too, right? Like resort places that are like, right. you have to take a boat out and there's no internet okay. in South Carolina, North Carolina. I know Tabby Island is one of those ones, right? Yeah, is maybe. it Tabby Island? Anyway, I think that is right. I'm, I'm hanging up. I'm, I've, I've got my bubbly poured now. So cheers to everybody. Cheers. <laughs> I'm doing my tea again. Okay. Although the limoncello, maybe that will work out. That might that might make me feel even better. So, so the good news is I'm having bubbly because I don't have to drive to the hospital. My mom oh. is staying another night. So for okay. for those of you that know, my my mom's had some health issues and um she went to the hospital a few nights ago. She's doing okay. It's nothing to do with COVID. She had a bleeding ulcer, which oh. we didn't know, which is why she was getting dizzy. So she's doing okay, but they're keeping her another night. So I can have a glass of bubbly. I don't have to go pick and her up. Relax for <laughs> All right. And relax for free. And relax a little bit with everybody else. Yep. Yeah, good. All right. So now, okay, you good. think that they will be about ready now? I think so. I think so. So if you don't have your tree trunks on there, you can go ahead and put them on there now. Okay. And Should be dry right now, yep. right? Yep. And then the next step that we're going to do is that we're going to switch to even that tinier brush. Okay, so that smaller brush. And we're gonna work on doing our scrolls. So I'm gonna grab white again. I think I just need to get white, period. My white's yellow and blue. <laughs> yeah, it's because I was painting with my paint earlier today and I just used the same palette so I don't waste it. All right. Well, I've zoomed in <clears throat> awesome tiny brush, rinse and dry. So all we're gonna do is kind of start working our way from, it, and it doesn't matter how far down you start or how far up you start. I'll start right in the middle, work our way up. And kind of work on a little scroll here. But now if you put the scrolls in here, you wanna make sure that you got room for your birds, For right? some birds. Yeah, I mean, they can overlap, it's okay. Okay, okay. Yep. So I'm just gonna go over that edge again. So I sort of make the end of it a little bit thicker so that the outside edge of it is thinner. Okay. So real light pressure with those little scrolls. So we'll just do these every so often on those trees. And you can make that edge thicker as you get closer to your tree trunk and thinner as you move away from your tree trunk. Okay. Now, if you want to add smaller ones off of the larger one, 
you can always do that too. It depends on your creative freedom, how you want That's to express right. yourself. That's right, yeah. We always usually say, and I didn't, my, my painting, painting is, is not, not going to look, look like, like my painting, painting and, and your painting is not going to look like my painting. painting. <laughs> And it's not about perfection, it's yeah. all about expression. It's true. Those scrolls take a little bit of time to get used to. Right, so take your time and um, do your scrolls whatever way you like. That's right. And if you haven't been used to doing these scrolls, yeah, it does take a little practice, it takes a little time. Yeah, it's sort of hard for people to see how you actually do the scroll. I know, because my hand's in the way. way. Yeah, we need a we need a camera angle, different camera angle. How about if I do this? Can you see it better that way? Yeah, I can see it. Okay. Do it slowly. Okay. So when I come up from the side of my... Yeah. There you go. Okay, and then I kind of come back around down to the trunk. And do another one like that slowly? Yeah. I'm gonna come this way. I'm gonna overlap, which is okay. Okay. I can't believe Holly is quiet. Maybe Aiden covered her. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's all I covered can her cage. Yeah. <clears throat> And that's why Rascal is jumping around. I don't know what Rascal's deal is. So you can fill this in as much as you want to. You know, like if you want this, this whole area filled in, you can kind of go back with the little scrolls on the other side. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Give you guys a and when you're finished doing all those scrolls and you rinse and dry rinse and dry that tiny brush okay right see how it says yeah my canvas is too wet <laughs> so i'm getting a hair dry there you go that works too that works too yeah <laughs> I've watched people just take their cameras and just start whipping it around. <laughs> we have seen that. <laughs> so um, you did all of the squirrels That's right. for all of your trees. Yep. And then um, when they're ready, what, are the, what will be the next step that you're going to do? So our next step that we're going to do is go ahead and add our um, details of the brown in the trees. So same, that same tiny brush for detail. Yeah. You're just gonna grab a little bit of brown at a time. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm gonna pick one side or the other of the tree. So I usually pick the left side of my tree. I don't know why, I just do. So I usually come down the left side of my tree. Skip over your scroll if you have a scroll there. Right, your branches. Yep. And then you're gonna come under the branch side or the scroll. We'll just sort of continue down. Again, come up under that branch. It's kind of like the shadow of each one of those. Okay. Come all the way down to the ground. And then. And you're just going to do the left side. I did the left side. I mean, you can do some of the, the right side too if you want to do a couple of like little broken lines, I call them. Mm -hmm. So I'm not doing a full line down, just a couple of those little broken lines. Okay. And then to show kind of those ridges in those birch trees, you're just going to do a little curves <laughs> and alternate from right side and left side. So a little curve. So if it's curved, it helps show that the, sh the tree trunk is round as opposed to just doing a straight line back and forth, right. which will make it look flat. Okay. So we want little curved lines every so often. 
on either side. Yep, so you can kind of alternate some on this side, some on this side. And then just come around the bottom edge of those little scrolls that you got. Okay. Underneath, on the bottom of the scroll. Right, so I'm going underneath the bottom of the scroll. Real careful. And it doesn't have to be perfect, doesn't have to be the entire thing. Right. It's just, you know, painting is illusion, all about illusion. It gives us the illusion that there's a shadow under there. It's a little darker. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> we'll come down this tree, do the same thing. All those little broken lines on this side. And then. All right, so you're going to take your time and do all of your trees. Yep. And then alternate some of those little curves, those ridges. Rinse and dry if you have to. Get that brush clean and back to a little point so you have a nice fine brush tip for doing those little areas. Okay. We'll talk about some other stuff we got. What else we got? Uh, sure. I well, I was going to wait for a minute. Okay. I was going to back out. Okay. All the way and show our backdrop. Mm, yeah. We had this backdrop made yesterday mm -hmm. for our session that we had with our viewers yesterday for the Polar Express. It was so good. So we good. had a nice little turnout, and we had a lot of fun. <clears throat> have people sent in their pictures? People have been sending their pictures already. They have been. A lot of people had a joyous time with us last night. Um, a lot of people ordered kits uh, weeks in advance for that, for that particular session last night. <laughs> where they had um they had a hot chocolate they had um some cookies yeah they had a golden ticket <laughs> and they had a bell yeah at the end we had everybody ring their bells <laughs> and uh everybody was drinking hot chocolate aiden made aiden made mommy some chocolate it was really good too <laughs> oh yeah <laughs> Connor, your sound, I don't know what's going on with your sound today. It's like super muffled. I don't know loud. if that was Connor. No? I thought it was I Connor. I don't think so. <laughs> it was Connor. I don't know. We're having technical difficulties over here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I thought it was him earlier when it was like that. I was like, I can't understand you, buddy. <laughs> I feel bad. Yeah, but we had a wonderful evening. We did. It was so good. Well, it was, it was an fun. afternoon, actually. It was an afternoon. We had a great time. And that was a painting that even I was originally nervous about. It was a tough painting. There was a lot of little instruction to that. Yeah, well, I got her through it because mm -hmm. I kept telling her it was a great idea. And it, it was great. Good. It was our every month. Yeah, and see, Connor's ringing his bell from last night. <laughs> So they were they joined us last night. It was fun. Yeah, we like to create interactive experiences where it's not just me putting paint on the canvas. Um, while and and I say this every time we do this, it's not about putting the paint on the canvas for me. It is about us coming to you and spreading joy and giving you some self care time. Whether it's time by yourself, whether it's time with your family, whether it's time with girlfriends and you're FaceTiming or Zooming or whatever it might be. Right. Um, it's just to take your mind off of everything else going on right now. Um, we know that we can't be in person with many of the people that we want to be with. So um, we encourage you to get your friends together and take a couple hours out of your week, not think about anything else except focusing on just creating, just create your piece. And that's, I love, um, Heather, did you ever get your bracelet for me? But th there's a bracelet that I bought for um, for giveaways by Alex and Ani, and they say, create your piece. Um, and that was just like, it so spoke to me. 
So we want you to enjoy that. We, we just want to bring. I did get that. Thank awesome. you. And I'm, I'm blow drying my canvas still. <laughs> <laughs> see my blow dryer. I don't know if you see it. Yeah, I see it. <laughs> it's fine. actually my mother's blow dryer because mine's upstairs. So hers was closer. <laughs> oh my. I'm sure she won't mind. Nah. <laughs> oh my goodness. But yeah, so, so that's why we do this. Uh, that's why we, we try to um, give you free events every week, especially Thursdays, self-care Thursdays, whether it's a holiday or not, we're here. <laughs> now, okay. is New Year's? When is New Year's? Because New Year's, we will be away, so. Hmm. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, well, I was just bringing up the Polar Express because um, that video is up on our Facebook page. So if you didn't do it, uh, to join us that night, you can uh, feel free to join us in that video. It was a awesome. lot of fun. We had a lot of people join us. We did. And um, you can go to our Facebook page and you click on events and you get to mimosas and masterpieces. You click on the events section and it'll tell you what we have coming up for the next few weeks. And then it'll direct you to our website, which is mimosas, masterpieces, one word, <coughs> dot com. And then, um, yeah, that has all the information that you can get for any one of these sessions that we'll be having coming up in the near future. And speaking of future uh, events. Hi, Jen. Can we have a close up? Hello. Are you go back in? Yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> Jen, I'm sorry. Are we supposed to put the brown on? Oh, okay. Oh, sorry. Mark's zooming back in. <laughs> on all three of y'all. Thanks. <laughs> You're welcome. Yeah, what we got coming up, uh, starting off for the next year, is a new series that we'll be calling Zoom with the Zoo, where we'll be on location and we'll be doing paintings uh, with the help of the Lehigh Valley Zoo in Pennsylvania. That's right. Now, you know I just zoomed, zoomed in, in, so you're going to have to wait. So, to, uh, or I can hold it all the way back here. They can't see it at all. Oh, okay. I'm zoomed in right now. JK. So we'll have to wait. <laughs> That's okay. And then we'll uh, show you the things that we'll be doing in conjunction with our being on location yes. at the uh, zoo in Lehigh Valley in Pennsylvania. Yes. So anybody that's kind of local, tri-state area, I'd say, mm -hmm. um, there's a great opportunity for you to be able to come and be our, be our VIP guest yes. for the events. So we have three sessions that you can come with us to. The penguins, the sloths. January 10th. Sloths? No, uh, penguins. Yeah. January 10th. Sloths, February 14th, Valentine's Day. Yep. And then the owls. On February 28th. Okay. So those three events, we are going to choose a winner um, to come with us as part of our VIP package. So how do you get... How do you get the opportunity to join? You just purchase the kit. So when you purchase the kit from us, you're gonna automatically be put on that spinner. So instead of us doing uh, like little giveaways for these, we're, we're gonna put you in as a spinner, on a spinner, those that purchase kits. If your name is called or chosen, you and your guest are able to join us in person at the zoo with the animals. Right. Not only will you have the meet and greet session with us and the animals, You'll also get two new kits there so that you don't have to bring yours with you. Yeah, you just got to bring you and your guests. Just you and your guests. Yes. So we're so excited to do this with the zoo. Um, and then the fourth one that we're going to do, which is just going to be a Zoom, is the rainbow boa. Um, okay. For, for some of our guys that, uh, some of our young boys that want to do something a little more, uh, not so girly, I suppose. Mm -hmm. Just relax. Yeah. Thanks. <laughs> like he wants to get you to take him upstairs. So I know. Go running. He wants to go running. <laughs> yeah, well, that'll be our new series that we're going to start this start the new year off with. Zoom with the Zoom. We're looking forward to it. Yes. And we're looking forward to having. Uh, some of our viewers join us for the VIP opportunity. Yes, I'm so excited to be able to do that with you guys. 
All right, so our next step is we're gonna work on our birds. Okay. So if you wanna make blue jays, you can make blue birds. If you wanna make our cardinals, what you're gonna do is using that tiny brush, you're gonna grab a little scoop of that red and a tiny bit of yellow. Why do I change and why do I add yellow? Because the red that we have is really transparent. And if I put it on there, it's just gonna look like it's pink or purple. Okay. So when I mix a little bit of yellow in it, kind of helps it, gives it a deeper red color. You could also add a tiny touch of your brown to it and you'll get a darker red. I'm gonna rinse and dry my brush after I mix so that I can get it back to that fine point again. Mm -hmm. Okay. How did you get it to that fine point? I twist it on my paper towel as I pull it toward me. Oh, okay. Okay, so wherever you would like to put cardinals, we're just gonna start with like a little teardrop shape. So I'm gonna come on this branch right here, and we'll do a little teardrop shape. Some Let me people- see if I can go in a little bit closer. closer. Yeah. So wherever you want to put these little cardinals, little teardrop shape. Yeah, and then when you move your hand and then you get a good look at that <laughs> teardrop shape. <clears throat> and it doesn't matter if you overlap the other branches. No, it doesn't matter. It can be as big or as small as you want. And you can have as many cardinals as you want. Of course. There we go. Okay. I'm going to rinse and dry. These are teeny tiny cardinals. <laughs> There's lots of little detail in them. Yeah. So the next thing that I'll do with that red is you can either give them a tail underneath the branch that they're sitting on by just right. kind of pulling that brush down. Oh, okay. You can give them a tail off to the side. So right from underneath that little teardrop shape, just kind of pull that right out to the side. <clears throat> so however you would like to do this. So mine sitting on this branch, I'm gonna put his tail down here under this branch. Underneath the branch. Yep. Okay. And you can rinse and dry again. All right, that was pretty good. And then the next step for our I was gonna say owls, our birds. You're thinking about the owls. <laughs> I'm thinking about the owls. Is I'm gonna take, rinse and dry, and we're gonna take a dot of yellow. So a little bit of yellow. And on the bottom of that little teardrop shape, we're gonna add some yellow in there, a little circle of yellow for a yellow tummy. And yes, it's still wet, so it's gonna mix, and it's gonna probably make an orange, which is perfect. That's okay. Yep. So a little tummy of yellow, a little orange in there. And rinse and dry. <clears throat> you relax? You were fed. I know. He wants hugs. No, I know what it is. He I wants to be petted. There's food on the counter. That's what it is. Oh, there's food on the counter. Yeah. He wants some of it. Yeah. As soon as you said that, he just reacted. Yep. You got me, mommy. You got me. There's chicken on the counter. I know. You got me, mommy. Mommy's making soup. It's not for you. <laughs> yes, it's not for you. Stop. Don't growl at me. Yeah, what's up with that? You're very impatient today, Rascal. What's going on? What's going on? Really? 
You want to play? Creepy. I'm not done. Yeah, she's not done. You gotta give it a chance. You gotta be patient. Don't look at me like that. <laughs> Just give it some time. <laughs> Mommy will be over in a, in a little while. <laughs> Take it easy. You'll be fine. Exactly. Oh my goodness. Lay down. You're so needy. Yep, so needy. You're so needy. You gotta have attention. <laughs> Jen, do we have to have a cardinal on, on all of the, the loopy things or no? Wherever oh, no, you wherever you like them, wherever you want them. So some will be blank. Yeah, okay. Okay, thank you. Wherever you want. There's no rules. That's right. <laughs> That's what we always say. There's no rules. So just to repeat the cardinal. You're gonna mix a little scoop of red with a tiny bit of yellow for that red color. And then you're gonna make a little teardrop shape on whichever branches you want them on. And then you'll pull the tail either to the left or right or even underneath the branch. You'll rinse and dry and then grab just a little dot of yellow and then kind of work a little circle in there for their belly on the bottom of each of those little teardrop shapes. Yeah, so. And then our next step is going to be, again, we're rinsing and drying, and we're gonna go to black. So using what brush? That tiny brush again, little tiny brush. So essentially, <laughs> the face of our birds is a little heart. Now I know it's too hard to kind of make a heart, so all I'm gonna have you do is sort of lay your brush down and almost make like a V. Okay. Okay, and that really makes it hard for you. So you're just gonna, right above the belly. Oh no. Oh, crazy camera time. Yeah, crazy camera time, here we go. <laughs> Let's go back. Let me zoom back in. Okay. <laughs> Time to get a little control. <coughs> okay, so I think I think my canvas is finally dry. This is Heather. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> so I'll be putting the uh, so for the trees, you just put them wherever you want, right? Uh, that, and you're making the thicknesses as big as you want. It right. looks like you on one of them you have it on the side almost. Uh, yep. So on this one over here, I have it on the side. So I did like one that's about an inch, one that's about three quarters of an inch, one that's about an inch, but it doesn't matter however big you want them to be. So in it, that way it gave a little depth perception, like some are in front and some are in yeah. back. It looks, it looks awesome. You're yeah. so good, Jennifer. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm zoomed in again. Awesome. I got in control again. <laughs> you got control again. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So I'm just laying that brush down and almost making a V. Right above where you made Right above that little orange circle that you made. Okay. Okay. So again, just sort of laying that color down on there. Yes, yeah, see, I want to get close enough that they can see, see how that you're making this V. Yeah. Did we do it? Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, maybe it's I gotta practice with this remote control because it's like when you go all the way in, then, then it, it's like then it just kick, clicks in like, oh, you want to go all the way around? No, I don't want to go. <laughs> I just wanted to go all the way in. <laughs> and then I tried to stop it by pressing home. And it's like, oh, now you want to go around? Again? No, I don't want to do all of that. All I wanted to do was move all the way in as close as possible. Oh my goodness! It has all of these, uh, you know, all of these different. Functions, bar, near, manual focus, zoom slow, zoom fast. Now, all I ever play is zoom slow. <laughs> and I press that button and all of a sudden I get all this other activity. I don't even know what I even ask. And then you got right, left, up, down, and home. I didn't even touch that. So how do I, you know, why is it going to the left? Why is it going to the right? I don't know. <laughs> it's a defective remote. Okay. 
So while you've got that black on that little brush, rinse and dry a tiny bit of black, and then you can kind of alternate some of those little lines again. Those some of those little uh, curved lines in the left and right mm -hmm. on those birch trees. Yeah, I'm pretty good now. I'm zoned in real good. They could see how you did your little bees with the black. Ah, right. Because you made your little tails. Yep. And then the little uh, tummies. Mm hmm. Now, when you finish that, then I guess you could show the pictures. I'll zoom out. Okay. And then you can show the pictures that we have for the VIP opportunities Ooh, yeah. coming up with the Zoom with the Zoo. Absolutely. Love to show you those. And all of those, none of them have sketches. Jen, is that black paint now that you're putting on the trees? Yep. So now I just. Was that again? Yep, so now I just went from my rinse and dry and then got a little bit of that black. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's good. Okay, great. Thank you. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. All right. <clears throat> there you go. Very good. All right, so what else do we have coming up in January for the new year? We're planning on doing a live event on YouTube. That's right. But we're going to have it set up by our viewers. Right. We're going to come out with a questionnaire or just a, a great, live yeah. event. We'll have people start. We can try and do a poll on the website. On Facebook. Or on page. Facebook. On Facebook, yeah. Yeah, and then they'll decide uh, when we'll uh, go live on YouTube and what we'll yeah. be paying on YouTube. Yep. yep. Good idea. That'll be something new that we'll be planning on doing. We plan on doing some live events during next year. Uh huh on YouTube as well as Facebook. Yes, we are going to start to move in that direction, I think. <clears throat> and then we're gonna do a Bob Ross tribute. Right, we're gonna have to plan that, a Bob Ross tribute. <laughs> That's all gonna be in the month of January or just beginning of the year? I think we're gonna try and get it into January. Okay. Um, I have to start putting those out now because yeah, because it's going to be January very soon. I know we have lots of private events that didn't make it in December booking in January now. So okay, <clears throat> and just to keep up on us and where we're going to be and what we're going to be doing, you can easily just go to our Facebook page and click on events, and that's usually where we first post. That's right. What's coming up? Yep. Then. Uh, if you see things that you like on Facebook, then you go to our website and then that's when you sign up for each event. So how are you doing? How's everything going? I'm okay. I was letting everyone uh, Everybody catch, catch up. up and yep. Making their cardinals. <clears throat> and their cardinal tails. Yep. And then their cardinal tummies. And then their cardinal faces. Yep, yep. We have one or two little steps left, and that's it. Okay. Yeah, that's it. So after your, um, after your little hearts, or after your little, uh, <laughs> what was I calling them? Bandana, bandit. Those little oh, yeah, eye little, um, <laughs> yeah. Uh, then all we're gonna do is rinse and dry that tiny brush again and grab teeny tiny little bit of white so that you can do two little dots inside those heart areas. Two dots. Two little dots. You're gonna have to kind of wipe off your paintbrush after Each every time, set. Right? Yep, because your brush is uh, or your paint is wet. Right, make sure your brush is pointy. Yep, so you're just kind of dotting those little white areas right on top. I've got it zoomed in really well so they can see those. Awesome. Two yeah, little you, dots you're putting in. Yep, you're basically just like laying a little bit of dots of paint right over top of those 
black areas. Now, Suzanne says, if I win any of the VIP prizes for the Zoom with the Zoo, mm -hmm. I would like to donate my prize Aww. to a deserving child. Oh, that's so cool. That really would be cool. That would be awesome. Well, I can tell you, I have a couple of kiddos in mind that would be ecstatic for you to do that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I've had, we've had a few people that are like, how do I just pay to be there? And then we're like, we just, we just don't have it like that yet. We're just, we have to keep, um, we have to keep it to a minimum of six people total so that is um the zoo has two people that are going to be there right um uh, it is mark and myself and it is a guest and one other person so yes so that's all we can do right now <laughs> but we hope that um after the spring that we're able to go out and do this like in person at the zoo and have a whole class i don't even want to say class a session at the zoo. Right. That's so everybody really can like. come to. Right. Right. So people can just come. Right. So we can have like a live event. Correct. You know, like we would normally do before we even had all yeah. this happen. Yeah. We'd like to. So we'll be working with the zoo to talk about um, possibly helping out with, um, you know, you'd get like a, a membership to the zoo for the season or whatever. Right. We're going to do what we can <clears throat> to work with the zoo and um, see if we can make this yes. a special type of a thing. Right, because we're also giving back. The zoo is actually a nonprofit, so we will be giving back to the zoo. So those Zoom sessions that we're doing, we've paid for. We've paid the zoo to be there and to do this. Right. But um, we'll be giving money back to the zoo based on, you know, what's the funds coming in to. So right. we're excited for it. And I, and I wanted to so badly be able to say, let's just do a giveaway and then you can kind of like buy a chance. But that is a big illegal no-no right? Can't do for that. the state of New Jersey. So we cannot do that. Right. <laughs> Originally it was kind of my, my thought process, but I already knew it was like not the right thought process. Okay. <laughs> New Jersey is so strict when it comes to money exchanging hands for goods. Right. Period. They want their cut of everything. Period. Okay. <clears throat> Nothing wrong with that. <laughs> All right. So the very last step for our birds is little beaks. So we're just going to mix a tiny bit of orange. So I'm going to take that red that we mixed yeah. and just add a little bit more yellow to it to make an orange. Say that again. So I'm going to take the red that we mixed, mm -hmm. this red for our cardinal and I'm gonna add a little scoop of yellow to it so that we get an orange color okay all right I'm gonna rinse and dry my brush to get it back to a point after I mix so rinse dry twist on your paper towel twist on your paper towel to make a point back to a point and then we'll take a little dot of that orange and right at the V of that nose we'll just kind of like do a little dot and then pull out and pull away dot or like, and then or like pull suzanne away. says um <clears throat> i think i'm going to just wait until it's dry and then use my gel pen oh that works too the gel pen works good that should work yep so there we go there's our little beaks oh okay <laughs> wow that was fast very little beaks <laughs> yeah and then if you want to add um a little bit of I forgot kind of coming around the top of the the snow if you want to with some of that brown yeah i gotta back out for that oh sorry go ahead you can do it but yeah it just kind of came right over some of the top of the snow with that brown but that's all nothing major nothing major and that's it sign and date your painting so you're gonna use your tiny brush you're gonna add a little bit of a little paint and then some initials and the date or the year. Not okay. bad. And that's it. Just a little guy today. But where's the other one at? Oh, I'll show you that. <clears throat> What's that? I, I bought the right size frames for these guys. So. 
So, Mark, could you just zoom in a little bit closer, just so I can see how Jen did her did the beak, please? Yeah, zoom back in. You mean? Yeah. Yeah, so I, 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 I just want to see what the beak looks like. So I'm having trouble seeing the beak. Yeah. Super, super tiny. Yeah. Can you see them? Uh, yeah. Okay. Thank you. You're Yeah, I'm zoomed in right now. Goodness. Yeah, he's getting excited now. Oh. Oh. Oh, don't start whining. <laughs> Come on, rascal. Don't start whining. <laughs> Really? It's Are like you kidding me? He is such a big man. <laughs> oh my goodness. You are such a big ham rascal. I can't believe I don't believe it. I start whining. Mm -hmm. Really? Yeah. Are you really serious? Oh my gosh. <laughs> chatter. <laughs> you chatter in your chatterbox. You're okay. You're a little spoiled baby. Yes. You're right. a spoiled bride. You know that? Yeah. Rascal is spoiled bride. <laughs> That's right. I'm talking about you. Yeah. He's looking over at me like, why are you going to talk about me? Like yep. I know. That's All right. right. All right. So. All right, we're going gonna to. Check everybody's come, paintings out. Yes, yeah, so I'm going to come around and check everyone's paintings out. I just wanted to show you, um, even if it's a small little 8 by 10 you can grab these little floating frames. I can send you guys a link for it if you like, but it makes a great gift. Frame it. It looks wonderful. Yeah, frame picture. <laughs> just make sure you get the right size. Get the right size since I bought the wrong size many times. Okay. <laughs> I'll put this one up here. Hopefully it stays. There we go. Hey, so Jennifer, uh, for people that are lagging behind like me, like I'm sure nobody else is because I was, <laughs> had too much stuff going on, um, you'll post this later, correct? Yeah. So people can go back and we yeah, can post I this can on actually, our website too. Yeah, I can, uh, I can, uh, I'll, I can upload Sorry. it right to YouTube actually. Yeah. Okay, perfect. Right I'll just upload it right and to YouTube. And then, and then I'll share it uh, later to our social media and yeah. Um, yeah. To find it on our YouTube channel is just put in Mimosas Masterpieces as one word and you'll see our logo and you'll see our paintings. Oh, yeah. But there'll be a link on your Facebook page and stuff and you can send yeah, it to me I'll and I can send it out to you. Facebook page. Yeah. Yep. You got it. All right. All right. I'm going to put myself on mute again. Now we're going to have the fun part. Yay, here we go. We're going to start pinning everybody's paintings. paintings. There we are. Yay, good job. Connor and Mommy. <laughs> Great job. Good job, guys. <laughs> and now we're going to do Suzanne. Hi, Suzanne. Yay, it looks great. <laughs> Great job. Oh, very nice. Aw, that's awesome. Who else? Who else do we have? Mm -hmm. Oh, Lynette. There we are. Oh, I love the background. <laughs> that's so cool. Yeah, the virtual background is really Beautiful. awesome. Beautiful. Great job. <laughs> Aw. <laughs> Alright, Lynette. Yeah, that's really cool. Yeah, that's cool. Alright, so now we're gonna do Lynette. Lynette, come on up here. Oh, oh, very good. Beautiful. Yeah. We got a whole group. Yes, we had a whole group. Awesome. I told you we had a nice group. Nice job. Nice job. All right. Who else? Who else? Anybody else? Yeah, if you don't want to be in the video, that's fine. You you don't have to share. That's okay. Let's see who else we got. Uh, Debbie. Debbie. Yay. Oh, very they're nice. so cute. <laughs> 
she didn't do the pointy head like I did. No, that's those true. are adorable. <laughs> yes, they are. <laughs> they don't look like angry birds. <laughs> <laughs> They're adorable. Good job. Very good job. Should we get everybody? Anita. Anita. Let's do Anita. Yay! Oh, they're yeah, so see, cute. Look at the little eyes. Really nice. <laughs> they look like they're looking at you. Yeah, everybody did good with the eyes. Very nice. I know there's lots of little tiny detail in those. I guess they great. really got good at twisting their brushes. That's right. So, uh, <laughs> yeah, it takes a little practice sometimes, but it seems like a lot you of people are getting better at this. Very nice. Very good job. Did we get everybody? Anybody I think we else got everybody. Share? Everybody who wanted to share, we got them. Awesome. So thank you. Very thank you good. so much, everybody. This is fun. This was fun. It was a nice kind of. All right, I'm going to take you out, put it, bring it up to the gallery size. Break it. So guys, what, um, well, when will we do, I guess we'll do, are we going to do spinner or are we going to do name and hats? How, what are we going to do? Um, we, either way, we can do that. Um, we'll just have you guys, so anybody that uses our virtual tip jar, um or heather's virtual tip jar we'll have we'll put that up there we just want to get everybody's names and then we'll uh we'll choose you from there there you go okay and then i'd like to give so we've got two art kits we've got the lights we got the wine we got the let's see two art kits the wine the art two art kits wine i'm let's see that i'm so tired right now light so we've got what five things five right. things i think two kits yeah um the, the candle holder lights the light yeah. and um uh, wine the and the wine that's fine well we got two lights actually two kits oh, and wine right. yeah so five so it's five yeah um but one of the kits i'd like to um i'd like to i'd like to pick sv tags would like to pick the best effort on um one of the yeah. art pieces and they'll get an art kit okay. to keep them motivated so it'll be four spinner gifts or however you want to pick it and then i'll pick one of the i'll pick the art kit to go out all right that sounds good. does that sound good yeah yeah awesome all right cool let's see if i can get the different view here all i see is train what the train the train in the background looks awful it's fantastic, you guys. We had so much fun yesterday. So did you make that yourself? Yeah, we set it up. I mean, I bought the backdrop. She bought the backdrop and then we just added the lights and made sure everything looked good. We had little golden tickets hanging down from the ceiling and it looked like they were floating in the air. All right. Well. Mm -hmm. Thank you. You're very welcome. Thank you guys all so much for joining us tonight. We'll see you guys uh, Tuesday. That's right. Tuesday. Thank you. Tuesday, yeah. Tuesday night for the Peanuts Paint It Forward Zoom. That's right. So Thank you. So, Jen so, Jennifer, on the West Coast here, we have Happy Hollow Zoo, and they have um, a red panda. Yeah. And I, I don't think they have a sloth. They might be getting one, but um, I'm sure they would love to do an event with you. And I'm going to propose that when all this is said and done, you should come to California and have your open, you have an open place to stay here. We've got an extra room. Awesome. <laughs> and uh, I'm going to propose that you do an art event with them, either virtually or with them so cool. live when people cool. can do that again. So like I know the marketing director, I'll, I'll, I'll chat with her. Um, and her husband's actually the one that did the article on our 201st and 200th show. So, um, so maybe he'll even do a little publicity for it as well in the San Jose Mercury. Um, I'm only yeah. an hour and a half from there. I will drive out. Oh, yay. Oh, wow. Yeah. Is that that would be awesome? fun. Yeah. Hi, Susan. That's me. <laughs> Susan. That would be fun, Susan. Can I see everybody's painting one more time? Sure. Yeah, everyone. everyone everybody want to put their paintings up? We'll start with Suzanne. Beautiful. Wow, you guys. Yeah. So cool. <laughs> Who else? We can get everybody else. Let's go on across. Matter of fact, <laughs> let me see. Everybody. 
We're gonna do the gallery view. Mm. Yay! Yay! Come on, Debbie. Good job, everyone. Come on, Heather. For us. Let me uh let me put there it in the gallery. Where's ours though? Oh. Everybody's got their paintings up on it. I'm gonna start pinning people. Yay, Heather! There we go. <laughs> well, I like the the last goes. And she did it up, up and down. Oh, oh, good. Yeah. Thank you guys. Those are beautiful. That, but, uh, it's not her. done. Where, Marco, we don't see One, you. Where are two, you? Three. I'm hiding. <laughs> I didn't get my stuff <laughs> together. So hit that I'll get it together eventually. <laughs> got it? Yeah. One, two, three. Something's Yay, right. beautiful. Wait, do, no, do one uh, more because now my face is oh. right there. Oh, I get it. Yeah, let's do I one more. Two, three. Your reindeer ears, oh. Heather, you found them, yay. Now that shut it off because we didn't do it at the same time. Oh, hold on. Ready? One, two, three. There we go. Right. Oh, go. Good to go? My yay. power is 10%, so it's probably going to end. <laughs> and so, Jennifer, hopefully I remember how you did the rest of it and I don't mess it up, but I guess I can wipe the canvas. <laughs> oh, don't wait, Kevin. You got it. Do YouTube. As soon as, as soon as we're done, I'll um, I'll let it kind of decompress or whatever I have to do, and then I'll uh, I'll post it right to the page. What happened? Thank you. That was fun. You're so welcome. Buddy. Thank you. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, everybody. Thank you, everybody. Have a great week. Yes, everybody. You have a great week. Thank you, guys. Love you. Watch the national show on, on the AKC TV at three. That's right. Okay. So right. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Bye. 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 Awesome. <laughs> Bye. Thank you.